Hey, what's up everybody? Okay, day two on our bathroom remodel project and beautiful spring day. Uh, the day two, so let's see what's going on. We should have some plumbing, framing, uh, miscellaneous stuff to do, so yeah, let's check it out. What's going on in here? <laughs> Isaac's filming my butt. Sure wish you would let me know. You're Where's Steve? Dude, we wish we would have known you were coming. I just got back from the depot. Because it's an eye box. Plumbing. It's, it's an eye box. box. So it's it needs the three quarter fitting. Yeah, so I had to get some new. So I had to you want this off? Wild goose yeah. chase to get the damn. Uh, get the pieces we needed. And I'll just make it out of. Re I'll just reduce it all down and make it all out of copper. So I'm just, yeah, since I didn't have the, uh, I think there was a plumbing place. I forgot there was one off of 80. There's a one in Auburn there where they, they might have had the PEX adjuster. So it's straight three quarter male PEX thread yeah. to the adapter to a half inch. So I have to, but I ended up having them get all copper with a reducer. So I'll be able to just make reducers and then use the. There's an Ace Hardware right down the street. We went there too. Yeah. Oh, they didn't have it? <laughs> yeah, they didn't we have there. any idea what we were talking about. Well, what a, did they just have the copper reducer? But he only had two. He only they didn't had have two enough. Of them. We need four. We needed four. <laughs> he only had two. Yeah. So, right. so yeah. So, but we got it. So I've just been dicking around here, getting this thing going. So we're gonna move move the trap to the back wall over there. As far as we can go. I don't know what kind of flooring you have us putting in here. Is it pebble or something? Yeah, it's pebble. So we don't want to use a tileable grate. Is that all they have? Uh, yeah, probably in stock. I'm sure we can get the the bottom flange, but and that's which just, wall is the shower head going on? I'm assuming that it's this one, right? It's this one. So yeah, I want if you to call. Standing, if they're standing on, you know, they're going to be facing this wall. So they pro we probably don't want it sloping down that way because then they'll be standing sideways. How are we going to move this vent pipe? How? From under here. That's what I've been drilling. I already drilled the hole, so I just got to drill it through the top. Oh, so it's going to come up right in that corner. Yeah, I cut it. I already cut the hole and it feeds up, so all I have to do is cut a new hole up there, find out what's going on up there, and uh, there's just so much crap insulation. I was hoping to, I was hoping to cut attic. as minimal hole in the, as the lid as I could, and then just reach up and make the new attachments. Right. Yeah, so we need to figure out what we're going to do with the drain. So this is how. how how much floor, how, how high is that? So we're like uh, two, about two Actually, inches, well, two, two. Yeah. So we could, we could have this whole floor floated up two inches. Yeah, that's what, see, that's what I'm seeing. What and, they then, and then we'll just drop down from, we'll drop down from, from the entrance right here and go down um, to an inch at the drain. That'd be more than enough. So yeah, we got plenty of room to go third lifts. Yeah, because we'll need, yeah, we'll need that at least, you know, at least the three quarter inch fall. I would at least give it a three quarter fall. Mm -hmm. It's 10 inches. Because we could put our, there's a, our line drain running this way right here. Yeah. Technically we could do that. So that's, I mean, that's the other option. We could go from zero right here and slope everything down this way but ah seems like it'd be better to have it slope away from the floor yeah i think it'd be fine to just we've done it before where we've said hey tough titty we're gonna put that over yeah here. i mean that's an option or we so. can just have them say hey let's just route your shower head to this wall and have the hook on this wall that's his bathroom so that's what she said this is his bathroom? This is, this is the home. This is his bathroom. So it's Jack's bathroom. Jack. So we have no to talk Jill. to Jack. And no, no Jill. Just the Jack. <laughs> it's not Jack and Jill. Just the Jack. We gotta firm this baby up a little bit. Oh too, yeah, that's huh? why I'm gonna dismantle it completely. Once I get all the copper and ABS yeah. out of it, I'm gonna take it. If I have to put nailers back here. I need to put an additional nailer in the back of that. Yeah. Yep. I gotcha. Okay, sweet. Hey, day three, let's see what the boys got going on in here. I think they're uh, finishing up the plumbing. They're turning the water back on, so let's see how they did. All right, John. 
Not John. It's me. What's up, Steve-O? Okay, I'm turning the water on. Go ahead, turn it on. Hopefully Isaac will be quiet. Ah. Oh, let's see. Moment of truth, huh? Okay. Uh, turned it on. You got it going? Yeah. Did you turn it all the way on? Me, are you talking to me or Johnny? Johnny. Are you, are you, yeah, just don't feed it all the way up. Or did you already? Oh, I hear a hiss somewhere. Okay. Yeah, yeah, the hot water is the one hissing on us. You got a, you yeah, got a small that leak? Was the one that was the hardest to deal with. But let me see if it is going to leak anywhere else. I don't hear anything up here. Oh, wait. I got it out of the pot. We just uh, crank that one on, Isaac. Yeah. Okay, so we're we're down in the crawl space and we had a leak in uh, one of the water supplies. It's where the adapter uh, changes to the PEX and we got a bad solder joint, so uh, we'll see if we can get that fixed. So it is uh, that solder joint right and see it's uh, leaking. So I think that's the hot water obviously because it's got the insulation. So we had to change it over to PEX and rerouting the supplies. Soon as we used blue. <laughs> they have red and blue packs, yeah. but uh, we didn't have any red, so we used blue on everything. Are you going the right way? Oh, there you go. There you go. Good catch. Good catch. Thank you, sir. Yeah. Okay, open up that pipe now, John. The hot, the hot side. The left side. You, you ruined your perfect record. Uh uh. I was just on a good streak. Yeah. Well, if you can get it on this one, that's not too bad. But if, yeah. We'll yeah. see. We'll see. Yeah, if man. not, the boss man might have to take over sure. and show sure. you how to solder a All thing. Right. Okay, so let's see if I can get it on the first try. Let's see if I can get it. Then it goes this way. There's a lot of solder on there. Okay. Do you I like it now? It. I like it. I like it. I think some of these. I think these brass fittings, sometimes you can overheat them. I think you can get them too hot and they won't draw the solder in. So I think I even had the torch up a little too high. It'd probably be better like right there. It's probably perfect. I had it up pretty high. But I think that's going to work. Let's check. Let's, let's test it out. I'll pull it. There's a lot of tension in there. How hot is this? the pipe? Still pretty hot. No, 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 it's not. Oh, at all. Well, that should do it, right? Johnny, turn the water back on. Yeah, let's do it again. Turn go out there. Uh, turn the. Yeah, turn those off first, and I'll turn. I'll get you on the phone. You yeah, make sure turn those angle here. angle stops. Make sure you turn those angle stops off. You got your phone down there. I got my phone. Right. So where's so. Uh, so that's going to be our trap, uh, yeah, wait, where's our, tra our trap's going to come off of there. Yeah. This was it. So where did you revent, where did you reroute this that This was coming, pipe? the vent was coming this way and up. So I just routed it through the, over there, through the other side. I had to pilot yep. some holes. You see I had to hit that plate and then the other plate. And I was lucky enough to get it centered so that it went all the way up. Oh, nice. And then routed it, and then they had an angle up there. It went straight up and then angled, so I was able just to tie back into that. Um, a couple of, just did a regular 90 here, and then vent 90s pretty much everywhere else. Very and, cool. Uh, and then we're ready for just a single turn here. We'll get a 45 on there. 
put the line drain right on the end right there. Line drain will go right against there. That's why I recessed the piping into the wall so that it didn't interfere with the trap. Oh, uh, good. And uh, so I marked the pipe with a red, you know, with a red tape so that if anything down the road's an issue, they'll know what's Oh, you know water. which one's hot. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, that's what I was saying because they're both blue, but yeah. that's all we had. Yeah, it works. It's just a color. Just a color. Beautiful. Yeah, that vent pipe, you did a really good job with that. That could have been a real headache. Oh man, it took me almost all day anyway. Slowly turn it on, right? So, slowly turn it on. Right, it's not going to leak. It's not going to leak, Johnny. What's that? It's not going to leak. I did it. <laughs> Just slam it on, man. Go ahead and turn it on. Just, uh, let, just it, let it let it seep in. <laughs> Steve we doesn't. don't know. We don't trust the other people's just, solder. There's a lot of other people who have done a lot of other plumbing. We don't trust their jobs. Yeah, they're. It's all coming together. Their solder. The so original yeah, solder looked like. Yeah. So go ahead, turn it on. If you're at, are you at full bore yet? No. Okay. Yeah, it's coming. We hear it finally making its way. To a full right now. Yeah. So if, go oh, ahead and yeah. put it on full. No leaks. Right. So you just gotta have the boss man come and do it, do it right. You're right. <laughs> I'm just, yeah, you're right. I, I'm just gonna go home. I don't even need to be here. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. You got your usage of the word. Well, thank goodness for my vacuum technique. Good job, Steve. Yeah, look at these old solders, man. They look terrible. Yeah, are you all, yeah, yeah, yep, you're all on. Come on in, bro. Uh, yeah, the originals, the original stuff is really funky. Yeah, it's all flux, right? I just, they just poop a load of flux onto it, and yeah, so that's what it's, it's just uh, sloppy oxidized too. flux, right? That's well, way, is. way too much solder on all of the pipes too. Yeah, it looks like it's like I was doing all these plants. <laughs> <laughs> all right, good work, good teamwork, good teamwork. It wasn't just me. I couldn't do it without you guys. No, but that's what happened. Was I probably overheated the, the brass. Yep, that happens a lot with those things. Strip them down. Right, here we go. Yeah, just, just... So if you turn the stop, you just turn it up vertical. These eye boxes. It's a ball valve. It's not a gate valve. So, yeah, you just turn them vertical. That'll turn the stops. That'll take all the pressure out of the, the lines. Another beautiful spring day in Northern California. It's got some pine trees. The azaleas are blooming. Beautiful. Nice. Do you want to open up a box and see what it looks like? Well, it's, it's this right here. Hey there. That's a. That's one of the finished pieces. No, that's, it's actually just one of those raw. It's one of the bull nose. Or... No, it doesn't have a bull nose. Yeah. Oh, it does. Yeah. Well, that's what it looks like, just with a little glaze. Those are uh, recycled roofing tiles. Oh wow! Look at that. They are. I mean, that's kind of like a composite from the. Let me see the glaze again. See the edge, the chiseled edge on it. You see from the front. Yeah, it's got like that slate. Mm-hmm. It's like chiseled. Probably have to set it with a... I'll still do a 16th, and then mm -hmm. I'll widen out to an 8th. Brick pattern. Mm -hmm. That'll look good. No liner or anything. We're just going to do just this. I believe so. Um, I got the pebble. I didn't bring the pebbles. So, yeah, we'll need the floor tile first thing anyway, so... That'll be nice. Yeah. Um, so we'll probably end up setting the floor first. So we're like the how many float. fat do we have? I brought 12. Well, fat, 25 deck, float the floor. Got a curdy drain. Oh, yeah. We did have work. We ran you out of Lardex uh, A plus 9. We'll probably need to re up on that. Thanks for watching this video. Make sure to watch the next videos coming up. We're going to be showing the tiling and the rest of the bathroom project. So thanks a lot, guys. And last but not least, I love you. I love being your tile coach, and we'll see you on the next video.